Welcome, Kevin Palacio here with head golf coach Ben Feld. We're in the Hillbush Golf Center. As you can see, it's a really well supported room by our alumni and our friends. Welcome, coach. Thanks, uh, Having a fantastic season so far. So, why don't you just give us some quick highlights about what's been awesome so far? And then we'll talk a little bit about CAs. Yeah. Um, I mean, first off, like we've just, we've got an awesome group of kids this year. Um, they're their energies, their energy is incredible. They're a blast to be around. Um, they're competitive on the golf course, but you know they're, they're lighthearted and uh, you know clearly just enjoy each other's company, which makes it a blast for AJ and I to be around. Um, you know we've had a little bit of a, a mixed bag on the on the course this spring, but um, you know it's all in it's all in striving to. Uh, you know, to get ourselves prepared to, uh, to play our conference championship here. And, um, you know, we had a great showing down in Puerto Rico, uh, first time playing UNCG's event down there, which was a blast. Uh, program record the final day, 15 under par, uh, was the best score in the field by five that day against some pretty good teams. Um, really good finish for us down there. Uh, we had the trip out to Stanford, which was spectacular. The great weather, great golf course. You know, it's all part of this growing process, this, uh, you know, this journey that we're on. And, and the guys have handled it well. Um, you know, they channeled that disappointment, came back, won the event at, uh, at Rolling Green. And um, we're getting better day by day. Yeah, so uh, I'd be remiss if we didn't talk a little bit about, you have a good mix of young guys and some older guys on the squad, but so heading into CAAs, this is uh, Jeffrey and Angelo's yeah. last garage dragon, so we need to talk about them a little bit, what they've done to the program. We do. Um, they've become synonymous with, with Drexel Golf. They were my first uh, true recruiting class, um, and they've been... They've been the heartbeat of the program um, for, uh, for you know, certainly this year, um, and really for the past couple of years. And um, you know, this place will be very, very different on the before those guys side and after those guys leave. When you when you take a, a look in from the outside, and it's no coincidence. I mean, they put blood, sweat, and tears. Uh, we've been through it all: ups, downs, uh, wins, losses. Um, elation and disappointment and you know we I love those guys it always will yeah so we know they're gonna grind coming up here in CA so give us a little about what's gonna happen down in CA's what are you looking forward to what what's gonna be the hardest part about coming my way with the trophy yeah um, I mean the hardest the hardest part about it is we play in a very tough conference we've got some some great golf teams that uh, that we're up against um, you know, I have I have no reason to believe that we're not capable of coming out there with what we're going down there to to do. Um, it's nice to have a little bit of continuity and consistency with the golf yeah. course we're going to be playing. Uh, really, first time uh, in my tenure that we're going to a place, uh, you know, back to back years. Uh, so we've got some familiarity with that. Uh, they were awesome to us from a hospitality standpoint last year. The golf course was spectacular. Uh, we were down there in the fall just to get some eyeballs on it for some of the new younger guys. Um, just great vibes down there. Excited to get back. Yeah. So we're in the Hillbush Golf Center. So you have tremendous support from uh, alumni, parents, friends, fans. So what does that support mean to you? It's the lifeblood. Uh, I mean, we're not standing where we're standing. We're not talking about the trips that we've done. And truthfully, we're not talking about the student athletes that are here being here without the support that we've received across the board because this place has become a draw and people now want to be a part of what we're doing. And the story has just become so much easier to tell because our supporters are so invested. They want to see us take those next steps. They want to see us at Stanford. They want to see us at Bandon. They want to see us hoisting trophies and their actions back their words in that. And it's humbling to, you know, to have so many people so invested outside the walls of this room. Um, it's it's remarkable. Yeah. So the next opportunity to support the program is coming up on May fourth, uh, the annual day of giving for the university. So. Stay tuned for that. 
Thank you, Coach, for everything you do for Drexel and this program. Um, it's top-notch all around, and Thank we'll you. talk to everyone soon. Go Dragons. Go Dragons.